All right, around the holidays, people tend to consume more desserts and other unhealthy food. Dietitian Ethan Baldridge from the Arkansas Heart Hospital is here with some advice to get us through the season. I was just telling you that I, I see all this unhealthy stuff here, and it smells better than the other side of the table. Possibly because <laughs> all of this is mostly cooked already. Uh, um, okay. Um, so you guys, you, you, what, what type of advice do you have for our viewers mm -hmm. here? Right. Um, so we're probably going to be eating unhealthy things throughout the holidays. Mm -hmm. We know this. What we would like these viewers to do is possibly adopt this one to five ratio. Okay. So for every one unhealthy food they eat, they consume um, five of the healthy. And if you'd like, you can start to, okay. to put these in the unhealthy side. These are all unhealthy hopefully things. hopefully they'll see... Um, how quickly this can add up. So Ooh. this is five times the amount of the container you have over there. So people might say, oh, well, you know, I don't eat that much unhealthy mm -hmm. food in a single day. But if you were to think about through oh my gosh. Um, Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, uh -huh. the day after, you can see how quickly that could add up. Yeah, that's so, not that much at all. Right. Okay. Um, and so this would need to be overflowing with all of this um, healthy food that we have over here. Mm -hmm. So this is just a good visual. Oh my gosh, that's a lot. For, yeah, <laughs> absolutely. So um, like I said, we know that, that they're going to be eating a lot of this. Yes. What we want you to do is eat five times um, in the healthy. Do you have any uh, suggestions or tips for people to make sure they don't like overindulge in the bad? Um, this is the best way okay. because we can only, our, our body's ability to consume food, we can only consume so much in a capacity. Okay. So if we increase the capacity of the healthy, mm -hmm. then we're going to be forced to decrease mm. the unhealthy. What about with and, like fruits and vegetables? I know a lot of people say, oh, I, I want to stay away from the sugary fruits. Mm -hmm. what, are, what, are, what is your advice with that? So in general, all fruits, vegetables, whole grains are going to contain carbohydrate. Mm -hmm. Some contain, let's say, more sugar. What we want to stay away from is the added sugar. Okay. It's not necessarily that we can't have fruit. Of course, we need fruit. It's got mm -hmm. fiber, vitamins, minerals, things that are beneficial, things that our bodies have to have to function properly. Okay. So we don't want to completely avoid those because this contains sugar. Yeah. This contains about eight times the amount of sugar, <laughs> wow. right? Yeah. So. Okay. Well, that's a great visual there. Oh, man. All right. Well, thanks so much for joining us Thank this morning you. and letting us know about this one to five ratio. All right. Let's check in with...